The magic of Fast Pencil really is in the preview button. Uh, once you've uh, outlined your chapters and you've done your editing and reorganizing and uh, massaging of your content, you've worked with your collaborators and you've made comments and edits, etc., and you're ready to actually see what your book will look like when it's published, you can click the preview button. A fast pencil is based on an idea that you keep your content separate from your design until you're ready to publish. And your content is all in the editor and it's stored in a structured way. When you're ready to publish, you're going to choose one of the templates. Now, these templates are um, the fixed templates that we've created for the online fast pencil platform. If you're a publisher or an enterprise and you want to license our platform and customize it specifically for your needs, we can discuss how to create new templates for you or templates that are specific to your uh, requirements. But as an independent author, we created these templates. And these templates really are professional templates that look fantastic and will make sure that your book uh, looks really great standing on a shelf next to any other book at Barnes & Noble. I'm going to choose the elegance template. I'm going to leave color checked for now because I want to show you what we do with the images. Um, but you can also uncheck color and have just a real nice black and white book created and ready for print on demand with just one click. Um, the other thing that's really important about our system is you can change the trim size at any time. And this is valuable if you started off with a 5x8 book and you realized at the last minute it should have been 6x9. Just by changing the pull down here, you can actually modify the whole book and re-render it um, in a few seconds as opposed to having a graphic designer rebuild the entire thing. Um, so I'm going to hit preview PDF. Our system will actually generate the PDF automatically and uh, I'm going to open that in Adobe Acrobat so that I can show you some things about it. Okay. Once we have this, here we go, let me bring it down here and show you what it looks like um, in s full view here. Once your book is created, we um, Fast Pencil automatically generates the title page. You can see here the title, my ebook memoir, the author's name, the publisher at the bottom. If you had your own publisher's account with Fast Pencil, this would be your imprint name here. Um, I can go through each of these pages and I can see some of the specifics that are created. Here in the metadata, you can see that um, the Fast Pencil metadata is automatically added to your copyright page. Um, but as a uh, publisher, if you have a publisher account, you can actually put your own metadata in here as well. Um, the table of contents is automatically paginated and created for you. Uh, each chapter is titled. You can see that everything in marriage and family, all the subsections and everything are nicely nested. They're not shown here at the top level table of contents. Um, if you did want to show them, you could choose that option in the publishing setup. Um, and I'll go over that when I go through the publishing setup for you. Um, but you can see essentially that the book is actually created in a way that has beautiful fonts uh, and we really just took the time to make sure that your book is going to be really nice when it's published. Um, we've had authors look at this for the first time and say, oh my gosh, I actually believe that this book I've been working on for 10 years is going to be published and I'm going to actually have it here in my hands. Um, and then I'm actually going to jump over here to the Baja Surf Trip because I wanted to show you how the images look. Remember I talked about, or in one of the previous videos, I talked about how your images can be float left or float right and how the text wraps around them. Here's the example that we floated it to the right and we put the text here around it. Um, and then I'll go to the next section here. You can see how the image here was left alone and it centers on the page nicely. Okay, and these were all imported from my blog post. And if you missed that uh, video, go back a few and you can see the uh, blog import section. Um, but essentially, this is how our system takes content that is unstructured and we uh, put it into a beautiful template so that when the book is published, it looks really fantastic. Everything is paginated. All of the title pages are created and the chapter pages are created. You can see the nice little uh, uh, page numbers in different places. Everything is done through our templates so that it really turns out nice. Okay, um, And then let me show you one of the amazing things here. So that was the elegance template and that was with color. So I'm going to uncheck color. I'm going to change the template to let's say memoir medium. Uh, the medium and the large designations 
are for the type size. So if you wanted to increase your type size, uh, a font font size one point, just go to the next size up. And we did that for um, larger print editions and stuff, with the, but to still stay within our um, template system. And I'll go to a 7x10 instead of the 6x9, and I'll click Preview PDF here again. And you'll see that our system will take the new data, it will uh, grab all of the content that you've uh, been working on, and it will filter that through the... Um, through the template that we just chose, the memoir template, and it will produce a new PDF. Now, while this is spinning, let me take a few minutes to talk about our templates. Um, the templates that we provide on FastPencil.com, the ones that are provided for the independent author that most people will be using, were professionally designed by book designers to um, create books that are very beautiful and that really uh, stand out in, as professional, professionally designed books. Uh, you know, we don't want to just publish Microsoft Word documents. We want to actually create books that look beautiful. Um, now, these templates are fixed templates. They, you, they cannot be modified. Um, they can't be, uh, you, you can't choose a template at this time and say, well, I want to change the font size uh, to 7 instead of 10, or I want it to be 14 instead of, you know, 12 or, or whatever. You can't actually do that with um, these templates that are on the Fast Pencil system. Um, there is an option if you do license Fast Pencil as a publisher or an editor. Um, if you are interested in uh, licensing the platform and having it deployed either on the cloud or in your own data center, um, that we can work with you to create templates that are specific to the one the way that you need them, um, or also to provide what we call transformation. Um, files so that your authors or editors or whoever's in charge of the actual publishing piece can modify certain aspects of the templates. So um, you might say, okay, I'd like everything about this template, but I want to change the font size or I want to change the font from uh, Helvetica to uh, Verdana or something like that. Um, but we can discuss that if you want to contact us for enterprise and publisher licensing options. Uh, we can talk about those, but the platform itself that you would log into on FastPencil.com, whether you're an independent author or a publisher, small publisher, um, you will be working from these templates. And again, uh, these templates work for 90% of the cases to produce beautiful books uh, that, uh, you know, all, all of the Fast Pencil users that, that go through this system are just blown away at how easy it is to create a book that looks really nice and, uh, and is rendered in print-on-demand ready for the press as well as the EPUB version which is ready for distribution and the Mobi version which is ready for uh, distribution to Kindle. Okay, So let me show you here a couple of differences. We made it bigger. Uh, we changed the, the template to memoir. You can see memoir has uh, no chapter designations, just numbers uh, as opposed to saying chapter 1, chapter 2. Um, you can see the font is a little bit different. Um, and then I'll jump here to uh, the, uh, let's go to a different chapter here. Um, let's see, page uh, 15. Uh, you can go back to where we had the um, images, and you can see that the images are now black and white. Our system does all of the grayscale conversion automatically, so if you upload color images, our system will do the grayscale for you. Um, or if you want to upload uh, images and they're RGB, our system will also convert to CMYK for color books. So it's a very flexible, very powerful system. And uh, like I said, if you just click the preview button and try out the different templates, you'll be able to quickly see the difference between them. You know, some of them have different fonts, some of them have different spacing between paragraphs, some have indents, some don't have indents. Um, it's actually a lot of fun and it's no harm at all in trying every one of the templates out at different sizes. So you actually can without, you can't hurt your project at all by doing this. It's, it's actually kind of fun. Go in and try the business template of 5 by 8 and then try the dragon template at 5 by 8, you know, or change it to 6 by 9 and try them all out and see which one you like the best. Uh, it won't hurt anything and it's actually kind of fun and you can see how your book will render in each of the different templates. Um, but essentially, that's the magic of Fast Pencil. It's a way to quickly turn content, manuscripts, uh, unedited, you know, I mean, 
uh, unformatted uh, content into beautiful books that are ready for printing and uh, print on demand. So the PDFs that are created from these books by our system are actually print ready and uh, our system actually uh, is, uh, goes to the full specifications of the uh, you know, most current print on demand printers and the books that come out are really fantastic. So that's the um, preview button. And then the next video we'll talk about publishing and actually uh, taking the step from creating the book and designing it to publishing it and actually getting it out there to the world.